Previously on Star Trek Online, the future past. Civil war between the Remans and the Romulans has weakened both of the races, allowing the Klingon Empire ample opportunity to strike Romulus and retake territories long lost. Then, a border dispute between the Gorn and the newly emboldened Klingon Empire results in a second conflict for the warriors of Kronos. The Federation peace talks continue to fail, and the Klingons continue their wars. A few years later, in 2395, Jarad, the leader of the Klingon House of Doras, is on shore leave when he's attacked by three strange, shape-shifting, tripedal creatures. Jarad manages to take out two of them and brings a third back to his ship, the Kang, for questioning. Subjected to uniquely Klingon interrogation techniques, the alien creature revealed he was sent to dispose of Jarad and assume his place, thereby infiltrating the Klingon High Command. When word of this reached the Klingon High Council, their attitude toward other races became even more aggressive. And all this while, the Gorn-Klingon War continued to rage, eventually drawing the Orions in under the Klingon banner. It's not until seven long years of war pass that the Klingons are able to achieve a decisive victory by seizing control of the Gorn homeworld. It's only then that the Klingons discover the Gorn government had already fallen prey to the same alien plot designed to subvert their own High Council, a plot that kept war raging for seven years. Of course, after the Gorn fell, the Noskin allies quickly followed suit. That's why when you play Star Trek Online, Klingons, Gorn, Noskin, and Orions are all part of the greater Klingon faction. Emboldened by their conquest over the Gorn, the Klingon High Council has decided to go one step further in the year 2404. Although previously surrendered to the Federation, the Klingons have staked ancient claim to the Hiromi Cluster and the sectors surrounding it. They announce to the Federation that they need to have all of their civilians, settlements, and assets removed from the sector within three months' time. In 2405, the Klingons invade the sector. They begin by forcibly removing Federation civilians from the planet of Korvat. Starfleet is mobilized, and they establish a blockade to stop the Klingon incursion. In the year 2406, the Klingons invade the Arachnus Sector. This has been a long-standing buffer between the Empire and the Federation. The war is on. Welcome to 2409. Reliance, watch your tick. You've got incoming. We are clearing on attack crews and breaking our flag. USS Hathaway heading to Sector Gamma. Forward, cover our rear. Captain, the Cortez is gone! This is the Columbia. We have sustained reactor core damage. Losing life support!